Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Jankville, USA. Today's super janky deck in the colors of Mardu, which is red, white, and black. Based around the card Offspring's Revenge. This is uh, back in Ikoria. Probably seen it. Nobody really played it that much. Didn't really get any footing, but there's a couple uh, new cards in here. Blood Chief Thirst, Magmatic Channeler. Uh, Tormenting Voice actually got reprinted, which is pretty cool. Skyclave Apparition. Like, I don't know. This card is... I love this card. It's in all my decks. Academe's Awakening is pretty good. I like it. Drana's pretty good. What else we have in here? Orag the Fury. He's good. And uh, just some of these dual lands. Black, white, dual land here. What is it? Red, white. Yeah. So yeah, based around this card, super janky. 50% of the time, it works every time. You're not going to be winning any competitions with this deck, but you can have fun 50% of the time <laughs> if you get, if it pops off. But, you know, this is just a fun deck, a janky deck. And just to play something different, I mean, everybody's out there playing the same decks right now, especially Omnath, like it's going around everywhere. Is it going to be hard against Omnath? Yes, it is. I've beat Omnath decks, though. Just depends on your draw. Depends on their draw, you know. Depends on if you go first or not. So, needless to say, we have two Blood Chiefs Thirst, one Magmatic Channeler, three Revitalize, one Skyclave Cleric, three Thrill of Possibility, three Tormenting Voice, one Heliod, three Skyclave, one Veto, one Agadim's Awakening, four Shatter the Sky. Nowadays, you pretty much have to either fight them or join them. So either you have to have sweepers or you have to play aggro. That's it. Two King Cesar, one Kenrith, one Drana, one Underworld Sentinel. Nobody's probably even seen this card. One Brash Taunter. Yes, he's coming. Angry Goblin. One Terror of the Peaks, three Offsprings Revenge, one Massacre Worm. One Morog, one Ruinous Ultimatum, and one Undo Inversion. And then a whole slew of lands over here. So basically, the idea behind the deck is using Offspring's Revenge, you want to get stuff in the graveyard and get it back. So you don't, it's going to come back as a 1-1, one, one, though. That's the thing. So it wants to have a strong like enter the battlefield effect or, or some reason why you want it back. You can't just be like, oh, I want this 6-6 six, six back, and it comes back as a 1-1, one, one, but what ca what happens when it comes to the battlefield? Nothing. Okay, I mean, it doesn't do anything for you. It's it's not going to be good. For instance, Skyclave, if it comes back, I get the ETB trigger, right? So I get to exile something. So that's good. Uh, let's see. Kenrith, I get to do, you know, his, his gain 5 life. I get to get creatures out of my graveyard. I get to give my creatures trample and haste. You know, I can still activate his abilities even though he's a 1-1. One, one. Drain, I can attack and make him take stuff out. Underworld Sentinel, I can exile creatures out of my graveyard. If they kill the Sentinel, then I get the creatures back to the battlefield. Rash Taunter comes back as a 1-1 one, one indestructible because he already is a 1-1 one, one indestructible. So he's literally the same thing. Tear the Peaks, you still get the ETB effect. So any anytime you have, you know, you get a little 1-1 one, one with, with haste. Oh yeah, they have haste, by the way. A little one-one flyer with haste, you know, and then you lay another creature down. Okay, you get the ETB effect from that. And if they target it, they still have to pay the three life. Uh, you get the ETB from Massacre Worm, minus two, minus two. You get the ETB, um, well, the ability and the landfall ETB right here. You get that. So all these here have a certain reason. And on top of this, a lot of these are non-humans, right? There's only a few humans in here. I think this is a human, and okay, that's a core. Vito is a vampire cleric. Yes, so like this is the only human, I think. Right? Double check that. Human two. I have two humans. Where's the other human at? Let me see. Let me see. The other human. Kenrith, of course. Okay. Forgot about Kenrith. So I can mutate onto any one of these little one ones. So like I can mutate onto Brash Taunter with my King Cesar. Now it's an indestructible three five with double strike, and I can fight with it. You know, I can mutate onto 
um, the Heliod. I can mutate onto, let's say, um, the Massacre Worm. I've done that before. So you mutate onto it. You deal four damage to something. It kills it. You gain four life. And then they lose two life because the trigger from this happens. And then you attack. Or I've mutated onto it when it was not back from Offspring. Just as a 6-5. And it gives it double strike. I mean, then you hit him for 12. It's crazy. I mutated onto him. Killed one of his creatures. He lost two life. I attacked. Double strike. 12. That's 14 damage. One hit. So it's pretty crazy, man. Morag is pretty sick. You can get him back and then attack and then you can landfall him after combat. And then everything untaps and get another combat phase. And then they get another plus one attack. So it's it's pretty nasty. Won a few games that way too. Alright, so let's try it out. Jankville, USA. Oh yeah. No holds barred. Be prepared to be the best deck of your life right here. This is the best deck in the format. This can beat any deck, hands down. <laughs> Until you don't draw lands. That like a bunch of tap lands, it's like three colors. This is the most consistent deck though. I'll tell you right now, 50% of the time, it works every time. Uh-oh. The Karn Mirror. He's got the same... Okay. Okay, let's see what we're working on. Pretty good, pretty good. You always want these. So with these Tormenting and Thrill, you want to basically discard the stuff into the graveyard. Then you want to get it back later. Easy win. Easy win, dude. He saw... He like... I just have a feeling this is Jankville deck, and he quit. I mean, that's the power of it right there. Look at that, 52% win rate right there. 52% win rate, son. I get all my matches like that, I'll just be 100% win. <laughs> wow. Wow. Makes you wonder what really happened. Maybe Macaroni was ready. Okay. I mean, I go first now. I guess that's better than last game, right? Start with the Triumph. Get all three colors. Ooh, I like that. I like that graphic. Ooh, another Triumph. Okay, I want to go to Temple, though. Temple, uh, land. Yes, I'll take the extra land. That'll give me five lands, and then I'm going to... Eh, we'll see. We'll see. First, I'm going to put Channeler down, and I want to do this. I don't want to do this just yet. If I start drawing lands, I want to be able to cycle this. Or I can just pitch it to Thrill a Possibility if I need to. Yeah, we know. You're a 4-4. Let's go. Sway oh, what the hell? Okay, I didn't expect that. See, this is my exact point right here. Get all these lands, man. Look at all these lands. Okay. I'm gonna pitch one of these. Do we got? There we go. There we go. All right. Let's just go. By the way, this puppy comes back. As a 4-1. Oh no, 4-2, sorry, yeah. Because it's a 1-1, one, one, but it gets plus 3, plus 1, so... Kind of neat interaction there. It's a 4-2 when it comes back. It's pretty cool. Alright. I just need a... So I'm saying, you have to play sweepers now. That's all you have to do, is just play a bunch of sweepers. Just play sweepers, you just get ran over. So we're pretty much dead. Pretty much dead. And this has pro multicolor, so I can't even do that. And I can't mutate on this anyways because it's a human, so. Alright. Act like we're not dead. Let's act like we're not dead. 
No. Don't have the sweeper. All right. Look at that. 50% of the time, it works every time. Let's see this. No, I don't want to compare this. I don't want to compare this, man. Yeah, we know. This is Selesniak um, counters or whatever. I was looking for my uh, wind chart, actually. That's in... That's over here, isn't it? Yeah. Stats and tools. Look at this. No, no. Where is it at? There you go. 30 wins, baby. 50% of the time it works. Every time. Try it again. Try it again. I don't know why they just didn't concede immediately. Like the last person. As soon as they saw that, that try land. As soon as they, I dropped the try on, they should have been like, concede. Can't do it. Oh yeah, now you want to give me the shatter, see? <laughs> oh, where were you last game? Where were you last game when I needed you? Now I'm probably going to play something I don't even need it against. We'll see. Oh. Yeah. Some type of tormenting voice. Uh, Sure, I have three lands and then I can pitch uh, an extra offspring or something if I need to. Are you going to mill me? Oh, this is Oracle. What the hell? Come on, are we still playing this? We're playing this like this self mill deck or what? One top, one bottom. I'm not gonna put that down yet in case I draw another land. Occasionally I do use this to get some stuff out of the graveyard, but like more often than not, I just use it as a land. Okay, so. Let's go ahead. I'm not gonna pitch the Skyclave yet because it's one of these. We're looking for a land. He's gonna he's gonna counter this, right? Are you serious right now? Wow, wow. Okay. Look out now. We have a professional gamer. Pro gamer. Look out now. He has all the counters. Move that, please. <laughs> they always kill it, dude, but it just, it does nothing. The value just isn't there. Like, now you have a basic 2-2. That's pretty good. Actually, I didn't want to draw those anyways. I need my lands. All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Scry me a river. Scry me a river. So he's probably got a counter, so, like, whatever, dude. Whatever. Just have your, have your counters, please, and hurry up. Do something, please. Cool. You just drew that. Still sitting on his counters, huh? What do I have in the graveyard? Terror. Terror the peaks. Alright, let's see what I'm gonna draw. Nope, don't want that. Casting this, because if he has a counter, then he's just gonna counter it and I'll get it back later. Okay, then he just has a kill spell. Yeah. Alright, hurry up. Murder it. Whatever you're gonna do. Murder us. Oh, you don't have triple black. Double black. He's gonna. Bounce it, okay. Man, that just... That just, man. You gonna counter it now? You gonna kill it? Bounce it again? Why don't you just do that in the first place, man? <laughs> God. Ugh. Okay, bro. Okay. This dude has all the freaking... Like, is this holding priority? Because he didn't have that land up last turn. It was still holding priority. Like, he still has, like, a kill spell or something. 
Anyways. Anyways. Dude, what do I got here? Skyclave? Yeah, I'll probably, probably Skyclave. Brazen Borrower, you're gonna bounce the Offspring's Revenge again? No? Alright. Let's get rid of your Brazen Borrower then. Alright, enough of that BS, dude. He could have had a kill spell and just kill this and then get a 3-3, but I don't really care. Vito comes back anyways, it doesn't matter. Like, I don't need Vito as a 1-3. I still get his activated ability, so... You're just gonna sit there all day on... God, I'm not drawing shit right now, dude. God. Alright. Ah, I don't know why I did that first. Ah, that was dumb. Oh well. Should have activated after combat. So I got that with lifelink as well, but just wasn't thinking. Wasn't thinking. I'm getting just trash draws, dude. Like, I'm getting nothing, man. Like, look at this. Like, I've had nothing. He countered this one, and I had, like, one more. That's it. Like, like literally, I have that just lands. Sleep of the dead. App target creature. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Are we really? Is this three? Oh my god. Can we just finish this game, please? This guy is just annoying me right now, dude. Are we playing this stupid freaking match? I'm beating you down with one ones, man. Come on. This is pathetic, dude. I have no draws. Can we just end this, please? This is, like, excruciatingly boring. You want to counter this? Then I'll just get it back <laughs> with haste. <laughs> No, you don't want to counter it? Boom. Good night. Uh-oh. Somebody messed up. Forgot about my devotion, huh? You forgot about that devotion, didn't you? Okay. Wow. And he comes back. Get him again, boy. Sick him. Sick him. Yes. Yes. Fifty percent of the time, it works every time. Toshi, please, please stop playing magic. Don't just tap somebody's crap down and counter everything, please. Be productive. Be productive. Be e productive. Okay, here we go. Some counter. I mean, some draw. Some try them. Concede. Are they gonna concede? They didn't concede, man. Understand? I don't understand, dude. They conceded by now. <laughs> Agonizing remorse, yes. Exile it. I love it. Ruin my graveyard plan. Thank you. Playing the only exile card. Oh my God! He's gonna take an hour to choose too. Really. He took my thrill of possibility. Wow. Wow. 
Okay. Something tells me that was the wrong pick, man. But what do I know? I'm no pro. But I would definitely not take their thrill of possibility. Alright. Oh my god, he killed it. Look out, mono black. <laughs> what is this music? I've never heard this music before. This is ominous, man. This is some ominous music. It's like all discard. Like, what are you, what are you doing? Come on, dude. You don't like it when them goats get frisky, do you? You don't like it when them goats get frisky, do you? Okay, so two options here. Mutate onto that. Kill that attack. Or Skyclave. Take away the demonic. Or I can just Skyclave this away. And then I attack and then I get this back. Two options. If I Skyclave, that leaves mana for Revitalize. If I do this, I don't. It takes all my mana. It is more mana efficient, though. Let's do it. Make sure I get the 4 or 5 on it so I can get more damage. Get out of my way, please. Take the Cesar. So if he kills my Sentinel. Like that? Huh? Like that? Huh? So that way if he takes my Sentinel, then I can get my Cesar back. Yeah, you can have three life. Go away. Go away. Nobody cares. Uh-oh, look out. Professional gamer. Professional gamer. Alright, so now we do... Let's see. Revitalize or tormenting voice? Let's see. What does he have at his graveyard? He has nothing. This is worthless. Okay. I don't even care because I'm gonna I'm gonna do this one more turn, so I think I do this first. Just to see. And then I do. And then I think I do this. Okay, there's a Drena. That's that's okay. What I need is my oh. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, I can ruin this ultimatum next turn. Look out, pro gamer. Just sack this. Get both my cards back. Hello. Yeah, you can have nothing. Cool. Cool beans, bro. <laughs> oh my god. This guy. This guy right here. Please, F off now. Getting on my freaking nerves, dude. Yep. Move. I don't have time for this bullshit constant 
infinite freaking Myers group. Come on, dude. A dead weight again? Oh my god. Nice. Nice Palaka. Alright, give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Come on. Oh my god. What is with these draws today, man? Heliod? That's not even good enough, is it? Should have just Skyclaved the dead weight away, but, you know. I thought that I was going to get draws. Like, God bless. I don't even have that many lands in this deck, dude. Oh my god, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why am I have to why do why do I have to beat everyone with one one powered creatures? Like, oh my god. This is not like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine lands. Jeez, dude, another land. Okay. Sure. Bye. I think that's going to help you. Go ahead. The more life you lose, the better. Trust me. It's been like this super annoying today, dude. <laughs> Good game. Yeah, draw a card so you can die even more. Good job. Bye. You're annoying. Go home. So there you go. That highlights the deck that I never even got the card of. Like, oh my god. My draws are horrible today. Horrific. And the enemy draws are just... Annoying as hell. What is that like? Infinite enchantments? Infinite removal? Infinite discard? Like, dude, enough. God. It's the reason you lost the match. Because your entire deck is just trying to mess with someone else's deck. And then guess what? Your deck didn't do absolute dog shit, so... I don't know why I lost. Because <laughs> you're not doing anything. Alright. Black. Black. Come on. What 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 are we doing We're here? Mirror shield. Magmatic channeler. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Give me some draws this game, please. Give me some draws, man. What are we doing? Green white? I mean this is like Okay, Dryad, you get another land. Okay. Alright. Torment. Discard Terror. Okay, that's good. I like seeing that. I like seeing that. Put that down. So. Let's see. Is this Hexproof? Gives it hexproof right. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> he can't even attack. I can't even do anything about it. <laughs> oh, he's gonna attack. Uh oh. Look out. Like, dude, we're really playing mirror shield right now. Oh my god, dude. You have one card in your hand, bro. Is this even worth killing right now? He has one card in his hand. <laughs> it's just, 
Oh my god. I'm not I'm not gonna shatter right now. Let's just go ahead and just sky clay this away for now. Back for one. Yank. Alright. Alright, so I might have to shatter now. Sucks giving I'm gonna give him a 2-2, two -two, but like, yeah, this this has to Oh, oh yes, untapped land. Thank you. That's what I'm talking. So we got what? Black, black, white, white, red, red. What would I need another of? Another white or another black source? I do need triple black, but I have So if anything, I would need triple black for the massacre worm, but that's till later. I probably will get it anyways, but just in case. Just in case, and I have another white source here if I need it, so black. Just in case, put it as black. Mutate here. Go away. Take it home. Take it home, Stazar. <clears throat> this is for stabbing me in 350 BC. <clears throat> I don't remember the year, actually, but you know. <clears throat> That definitely doesn't look like these are fifty percent of the time it works every time. <laughs> okay, that was just like a starter deck or something, but still, every victory counts. Every victory strokes your ego. Let's try it again. We need one. More. We need. Can I get a match where I can just play the cards in my deck, please? No, is that too much to ask? Here we go. Come on. Come on, is this redemption here? This is redemption, please. This is redemption. Okay, what do I do? Right climb or temple? I wanna thrill, I don't wanna revitalize. This'll be a black and this'll be a white. I'll scry. I can pitch that, but I don't need anything to pitch. I have a Massacre to pitch, so... Fine. Red-White Warriors? Let me guess. Red-White Knights? Yeah, Red-White Knights. Alright, so he did that, so just like... Go away, please, now. Make this as black. Alright. I'm just gonna look cool and hold up everything until he passes priority and then just give this. Because I'm lazy, you know? Like, oh, now I'm gonna do it, you know? I don't know why everybody does that constantly. Alright, pitch Massacre Worm. Draw two. Come on, give it to me. Come on. Pitch Kenrith. Come on. Shatter. Shatter's good. All right, put this down. I hold this to the last, usually, unless I know I'm gonna need it for something, but... What are we playing, Red White Knights? Yeah. That alone there is enough for me to shatter, to be honest. Okay, that's... Ah, oh, unfortunately, he's four power now. He's gonna get a card off this, but... Too bad. Too bad. All right. Scry Temple. Let's see what we draw. Another Tormenting Voice. I don't want that. I have two Revitalize. I need some action. Now would be a good time to get my... Um, my Offspring Revenge. Ooh, Sentinel. That is nice. That is a big daddy right there. Oh, yeah. Start attacking. Start getting these underneath. Oh, yes. Do you have any way to deal with this? A 4-5? Would he have exile effects? If he has exile effects, that's kind of annoying. Trample haste. That's not going to do anything, bro. I got Big Daddy Sentinel here, man. Is that double strike? Yeah. Alright. Take 8. I got 2 revitalized. I'll get it back.
Kenrith. Take him home. Take him home, Kenrith. Ooh. Ooh. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's revitalize first. I got a thrill. I'm putting this down now because I'm not drawing lands lately. And then, you know what? Do I do it or not? I do it or not. Goodbye. Say hello to Kenrith. Yeah. Sentinel's my homeboy. He took one for the team. He does it every time. He does it every time. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Show him what's up. Show him what's up. Magmatic Channeler, show him. Bring it. Come on, bring it, son. Bring it. One, two, three, four, five. I can still cycle. It's cool. All right. Good night. Good night. Say hello to my little friend. Who needs Offspring's Revenge anyways? I mean, this is what this deck is, right? Who needs it? Nobody needs it. That would be nice to get Offspring's Revenge. I mean, I got it in the first match. I had to beat him down with 1-1s one because he was so freaking annoying. What if you could do one more? Wonder if we can do one more. Let's see. Can we go out with a bang in Jankville, USA? Damn, that was fast. This guy's like, I'm ready. Sensei. Sensei, I'm ready. Tormenting voice and two double lands. Oh, this hand is gross, to be honest, but. Oh, man. Oh man, this is bad. All right, this is bad. Oh my God, duress, bro. Take the offspring, please. Don't take my tormenting voice. That's all I have. That's all I have left. Of course he would take it. Let's show him this. Show him that. Look out, we're going against the, oh my God. We're going against a professional gamer here. Ladies and gentlemen, look out, please. Double duress. Opening double duress. Into a grim dancer. Ladies and gentlemen, look out. Professional game And the Erebos sleeves. Professional. Professional gamer. Should we give him lifelink? He already has lifelink. Should we give him lifelink? That's the question. <laughs> Seriously right now, bro. Oh my god. There you go, buddy. Have at it. Alright, go home, please. Good old double duress, bro. If you're listening, do not put duress in your deck. Okay? And do not play Kenrith because guess what happens? He kills it instantly. Watch. Oh, really? You have nothing, bro? There was not even a snap on that. Must be sorcery speed. Do what he has. Really? I 
I mean... <laughs> Holy crap, dude. Elspeth, nice. Alright, what do we need? Black? Yeah, it's fine. Ah! You can look at my hand. Two creatures. There. Happy? I made sure to use all my non-creature spells. Uh-oh, look out. Rankle. Rankle is going to exile my graveyard, and I have nothing in there anyway, so... Are you going to sack Rankle to make me sack Kenrith? That's the saddest rankle ever, dude. This this is what he's gonna do. I knew it. I knew it. This is a super sad deck, dude. Like, if anybody has two duress in their opening hand, dude, they're gonna do that automatically. Can't even use Agadim's Awakening. He's gonna exile my freaking graveyard anyway, so. There you go, exile my graveyard because you're playing a ridiculous spell that you don't even know. Like, there's no reason this should even work. And then you're going to exile. Wow, extinction event. Okay. And yet you're never going to win the game. Yep. The saddest Drana with zero creatures in my graveyard. Because... Oh, well, thank you. Thank you for that. Now you have to return it. Skyclave? Sure, I'll get rid of that stupid thing. Oh, it's not legendary, that's right. It's gotta be non-legendary. Alright, let's just do this. Ah. Uh. Do that. Forgot it has to be non legendary. Come on. Wow, wow. We're not counting this BS. Like, we, we need a real match. The old double duress, rankle sack itself. That's how you win games right there. Beware the rankle sacrificing itself. For the greater good, which is to annoy your opponent and to concede. Okay, come on, man. Can we just get a game, please? Not some mono black bullshit. Like, come on, bro. Just want a game. I want a game, man. I want. I want to go back and forth. I want to fight for the right to party. Okay, okay, Magmatic Channeler. We got a mono red. Mono red. Start the life gain. Start the life gain. <clears throat> See what else he's doing. Raid bombardment. Whenever a creature Wait. Is this is this standard? This is not even standard. Why 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 is this card here? Anyways, let's go ahead and do this. Excellent. We do this. No, actually we do this. We do this because he has to lay something down. I could just do that, but then he's still up with this. He could get value off drawing and like, you know, doing the tap exile. We don't want card advantage. If he kills us, that's fine. He can take a 2-2. I don't care about that. Gives him zero advantage. Yeah, we know. They always kill it, man. I've been playing this card for the past, I don't know, what, week? Week and a half straight? Like, every day I've been playing this card. They always want to kill it. They're like, I gotta kill that thing. They have, like, a little vendetta against it or something.
Hey, Skyclave, now we will take away the raid bombardment. Completely ruin his entire game plan. Alright. So now we could use some draw. Would like to get Brash Taunter out. I think Brash Taunter is like game over. I'll trade a 2 2 for a 2 2. I mean, oh, it's a 3 3? Okay. Yeah, whatever. Whatever. Alright. Let's do this. Do I want to save the Triome? That's the question. Because I could cycle with it potentially, right? This doesn't matter because I have triple Triome, so. What is this guy doing? Like, seriously. The only reason you're attacking is because of me. <laughs> like, what are you doing? I'll, I'll do this first, just in case. I need the land, I guess. Come on, dude. No more lands, please. Thank you. No more lands, please. Come on, man. I'm flooding today, like, so bad. I have no idea why I'm flooding so bad today. I don't even have that many lands in this deck. This is insane. I go ahead and kill it. Thundering Rebuke. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right in his butt. Right in his booty. Nothing? Uh oh. Jeez. Oh my god, dude. I'm fucked. Thank you. Thank you. There we go. Like, dude, where's my action? Come on. Come on. We're gonna show this dude what's up. I'm gonna show this dude what's up, man. Offspring's Revenge. Come on. Come on. Kill the terror. I don't give a crap. Kill it. Do something, dude. You got eight men and four cards in your hand. Do something. What are you doing? That's what he was doing the whole time? Oh my god. Look out, dude. Pro gamer. Alright. Alright, now we go Brash Taunter. Hello? Hello? <laughs> That's pretty much concede, bro. Nothing in red can exile or anything. Nothing can bounce, so yeah, that's game over for you, bro. Say hello to my little friend. You gonna attack? You're not gonna attack? Well, I'm gonna force you. I'm gonna force you to attack. Fight me. Fight me, bro. Come at me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Yes. Come here. Come at me, bro. Come here, bro. Alright. Oh. Pink. Pink. 50% of the time, it works every time. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to the channel, YouTube and Twitch. My name's on the bottom left right there. This is the best deck in standard. No questions asked. This is the most consistent deck you've ever seen in your life, isn't it? And you're going to do it because I said so. I am your father.